Hey everyone, it's uh, Kimochin here, Ewan, okay. uh, we've got a uh, second game here against Everton at the Goodison Park, uh, I'm playing Wilfred Zaha up in front again, same to the lack of strikers that we have, well that's good, Jermaine Deef is back from injury so we'll switch him out for Wilfred Zaha, as Wilfred Zaha doesn't have that much good uh, rating at the moment, but in fact we'll play him there, because he's got quite a good average rating at the moment, so we're playing quite a good Everton squad, what have we done? I've only selected off oh, flipping on forgot to put Zizoko on. Yeah, uh, Everton have quite a good squad. They've got Kevin Morales, uh Nikita Yellowfish, uh aka Nikita Yelovic, uh Stephen Naismith, uh Johnny Heitinger and Jaggy Elka and Lane Baines. Uh, and also the goalkeeper that scored a goal. Tim Howard. Uh he's such a ledge. Who is old in the squad that plays Leon Osman, why not? Eh, closing down always and tackling hard. Always. Show on two weaker foot. So let's continue to. I keep forgetting to put it on a. Eh, do not. Thing way on Skype. So let's eh, be passionate and go out there and press me. So start the match. Eh, Jan Vertongen here. Good play so far. Bale again. Suzuka with his first touch of the game. Eh, let's look at some of the body language. The condition and the ratings. Uh, Bam last caught looked quite complacent. Milford Jaha had been... I didn't read that because it went too quick. Encouraged players should make more direct. And also one of my subscribers told me that I should put them to uh, the match. Thing is just down a tad because it was maybe just a little bit too fast as well. And um, we're not connecting most of our crosses. We usually do. Gareth Bale has been dominant in there for us today. Okay, that's quite good. Uh, Suzuko, Zaha, three of us trying to go for the ball there. Bale once again using his dashing pace down the line. Oh my god! That nearly went in. Oh my god! <laughs> what a save! <laughs> he basically crossed it from the side and it was it was like a cross and it nearly went in. That was strange like. Uh, Leon Osman here, cross, Vertongen, Avedo, Avedo 1-0 Everton. Oh my god, Brian Avedo. Oh shit. Right, let's uh, change this a little bit. He's, right, so let's look at the style I got with there after this highlight. Osman with the cross here, uh, Vertonghen with the fail header, Hugo Rich may have done a little bit better there actually. Yeah, so let's uh, look at this uh, style of playing. Uh, very rigid, you players expect to focus on a single phase within a very high rigid formation. Rigid players expect to contribute fewer phases with the ball. Balanced players blah 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 blah, blah. same fluid, but expect to contribute to more phases. It must be very fluid, see if that changes it. Pardon me. So, 39th minute here. Coming up to half time. Uh, Walker to Sandro, the beast that is. Suzuko, great pass to Walker. Lennon down the line with his pace. Crosses over to Bale. Bale misses a sitter. Bale should be doing better there. We'll bring uh, Jermaine Deef on at half time if he's in the subs. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. We've got a cold. Uh, uh, right, so let's basically say uh, aggressive. Let's be aggressive. Show me something else. Nothing once again. Right, so let's bring on Jermaine D for the thing way, and then we'll bring on Musa Dembele for Suzuko in the centre. And let's start this half. Let's go. Let's go there with high hopes that we're going to win this match. So Tottenham, Everton, half time starting. Now. Uh, body language looking unrested, uh, looking very nervous. Anybody's condition going quite down, Suzuko isn't playing so that's fine. Uh, quite, Diego Ruiz has got a ratio of 5, but that's quite shit ratings. Uh, no highlights so far, usually set tasks for me as Tottenham have been quite shit. The spirit of baby, I've seen Gareth Bale getting skinned all too often, oh my god. I thought he was brilliant too. So let's say uh, change this, set instructions, let's say... Uh, Where's a get ball forward? Yep, get ball forward. And one more. Where's does matter? I meant to do this. So let's overload. Three minutes. Can we get at least a goal? And in usual FM fashion, we have one more chance. Or do we? Do we not? Do we? 
No, we do not. It classically, if we if, uh, finish here, we get bet 2 1 0 off Everton. Far from please. Yeah, you better look switched off, Sandra, because that's all you do, right? So let's continue. So, yeah, we lose out. Let's do the press conferences. So let's read the first one, then we'll skip through one. That was your first defeat at Tottenham. How do you feel? Hey, I don't know if there's a lot of match. It makes me quite bad. Yeah, let's just do that. Yep, so bounce straight back, right? So let's look at the next match. We have got a game against Sunderland, then we've got the European Cup. Oh, this is our group, guys. So we've got Tottenham, Spartak, Moscow, Genk, and Borussia Spore. The only real challenge there is Spartak, Moscow, maybe Borussia Spore. Who's their squad again? Belushi's quite good. Alfred and Dai is quite a beast. Where's big? Is it McGreg McGregor he went to Borussia Sport? I don't know, probably not. But Sparta Moscow have a brilliant squad. They've got Romelu, the big 21 year old that is a beast. All night you've been a safe score, it's a blinder. Yeah, they've got Emmanuel Emanike, Dinier Bellinelli, and off, uh, who played in the Premier League for Everton a few years back, and Aidan McGeady, who is wanted by. Arsenal and Liverpool. Liverpool have no players and no money and no shit. So why are they even looking at players? To be honest, the only real player that I think is good is their Splash and Quiet. And who else have we got? Sam and Jessel. Who's he? Let's get a scout upon him. Why not? <laughs> and who else have we got? Christopher Peterson. Let's get one over him. So let's continue once more. Uh, I think we'll end it here actually. Uh, this being the third live com. Hope you enjoyed it, eh, uh, unlucky about the lose, but what the hell, uh, like if you want, it's up to you, eh, uh, just a big contribution to me anyway, thanks for watching, bye.